Hi everyone, this is Knowledge Topper and in this video we will see another very important job description and that is job description of a material controller. Basically this job description of a material controller it is not only important from the perspective of employer or a company but it is also very very important from the perspective of employees as well because in this job description we have included many important roles and responsibilities of a material controller that helps you know potential candidates to work on important requirement in order to meet the specific requirement of this particular job okay so every job description you know it starts with an introductory paragraph which is called as a job summary paragraph as well and generally you know it is a brief paragraph and it states about a particular job title firstly for which the particular company is looking to hire this potential candidate in our scenario it is for a material controller then this paragraph very important key roles and responsibilities are mentioned by the company as well as you know some important skills as well in order to find its potential candidate basically this paragraph is a summary of this whole job description and it includes all the very very important and key information about this particular job of a material controller okay so as you can see i have created this particular job description sample for you guys firstly i will read the job summary paragraph then you will see the detailed roles and responsibilities section and at the end you will also see the requirement section as well okay like if I can read for you guys this particular job summary paragraph our innovative and growing company is looking to fill the role of materials controller please review the list of responsibilities and qualifications while this is our ideal list we will consider candidates that do not necessarily have all of the qualifications but have sufficient experience and talent so this is our job summary paragraph after the job summary section we have the detailed roles and responsibilities section that provides more detailed roles and responsibilities that must matches with the skills of a potential candidate and one more important thing like all these roles and responsibilities are important and generally you know these are part of every job description of a material controller but because of the fact that a lot of companies also have different requirements so they can include and exclude you know this particular roles and responsibilities section with as per their own requirement as well okay like if i can read for you guys all these roles and responsibilities as a material controller your roles and responsibilities include maintaining adequate supplies of warehouse in direct materials dunnage consumables to meet site requirements while ensuring that stocks are not excessive thus unduly increasing project cost verify the stock availability sto's for aftermarket parts and sock will performs audits both on locations and materials to include lost parts expedites hot orders for customers and parts needed for service and sock while process and prepare appropriate shipping receiving paperwork work with aftermarket part coordinators to ship emergency orders for mozel update and maintain spreadsheet for stos implement and drive continuous improvements support efforts to drive cost and lead time reduction conduct and improve forecasting activities and methods in order to maintain effective inventory levels so all these are the detailed roles and responsibilities for a job of a material controller okay after this particular section we have the requirement or you can say qualification section this section includes the education skills and sometimes you know experience requirement that must include in a potential candidate in order to qualify for a job of a material controller okay like if i can read for you guys all these qualifications as a material controller your qualifications include maintain materials traceability back to material certification from materials received up to issue to contractor you must also have a ba or bs degree in purchasing business supply chain construction management engineering or technical or related field you must also hold a minimum of GCSE or equivalent grade C in English and Mathematics. You must also have a knowledge in supply chain, master planning and ERP systems. Culturally sensitive in operational working environments. Basic understanding of material control functions. So all these are the requirements or you can say qualification for a job of a material controller. And at the end our job description ends with a call to action paragraph that states how a particular potential candidate can apply for a particular job. Or in easy words you can say that how they approach to an HR department to get more information about this particular job of a material controller. So basically a medium of contact is written in this section by a company. And finally our job description is ended here. I hope you will like today's video on a job description of a material controller. If you like this video thumbs up do appreciate our hard work in creating this particular video and sample for you. By subscribing our channel Knowledge Topper as well as like our Facebook page. And do join our Facebook group as well where you find a lot of good material not just related to these topics but from many other career oriented videos as well. So this is it for this video. Thank you so much everyone. It's time to say bye-bye.